What's good everybody, this is your boy DV Kicks, man. We're back with another video and I'm bringing you guys the budget clothing haul, man. Budget clothing haul. What does that mean? That means I went out and bought as many things as I could for the set amount I had was 100 bucks. I did go a little bit over, but I will explain that, all right? But I must say for $100 or slightly over, I did very well. Just wait till you guys see what I picked up. So let's get into it because who doesn't love great deals? You know what I'm saying? And sometimes you just need those items that are just cheap for the low and they don't break the bank but can still be fresh, all right? So these items all consist of H&M, PacSun, Puma, and actually Banana Republic. I forgot that quick. So I did throw up a poll asking you guys where are some um, you know cheaper spots that you guys shop at. H&M came in number one. Right at the H&M, I believe it was Urban Outfitters and Target. I did not have time to make it to Target, but if this video does pretty well or gets a great feedback, then I'll do a Target one as well because I do like some of the items that they do have. All right, first two items. Now I figured, hey, it's about to get hot out here pretty soon. So might as well start grabbing some shorts. So these are nothing too crazy, but they are cheap. They retail for $12.99 a piece. So I'll be totaling up. I'll give you guys a total at the end of this, all right? But this is like a beige color, uh, sweat shorts, two pockets on the front, one in the back, nothing special at all. It's got a standard fit. Uh, this is a size medium and these go for what, $12.99. So these are just something real chill. You know, you can lounge around the crib in these um run errands and these that those kind of shorts all right no need to spend you know 50 to 60 dollars those are shorts you're just pretty much gonna wear every day or something like that all right same exact pair these are from h&m as well this is a black pair um i actually like these man i think these look pretty dope i mean for the price it's kind of like kind of like a why not you know what i mean um only thing i would suggest to you guys if you decide to pick these shorts up i would highly recommend I can tell you now because they're cheap and the quality is not crazy. Like for $12.99, the quality is good. I ain't gonna cap. But it's just a regular cotton material. Uh, definitely wash these inside out and also make sure you don't dry them. Line dry your clothing, especially when it comes to cheaper items. You guys are gonna wanna, um, you guys are gonna wanna make those last as long as you can. All right, next pair of shorts I did cop. I got a pair of patchwork volley shorts these are dope got like black green pink and white in it paisley print floral print pretty clean and it was either a small or a large because of the deal i just i had to get them because of the deal that they had going on buy one item you get two free so i just said you know what screw it i'm gonna get the large um but they do have drawstrings so just a slight pull and i'm good to go and for reference for my size i am 5 8 um, about 165, 170 pounds. All right, I'm like a 33 waist on average. All right, so um, I can float between a 32 to a 34. It just really depends what it is, but honestly, your boy kind of slowly phasing out of 32s, and you can't tell on camera, but we ain't gonna talk about that. Summertime coming up, man, so you throw these on with some Air Force One lows or some blazers or something like that, and just a basic tee. Uh, you're good, man, and the quality on these is actually pretty good. I like these. These are dope. They're not swimming trunks or nothing like that before somebody asks. Um, they are volley shorts. That's what the tag says, all right? Next item. These are from Banana Republic. Um, oh, by the way, the shorts were... I'll explain the Paxson deal to give you guys pricing. This is my favorite pickup. So, a little bit about these pants. They are from Banana Republic. Um, I've been eyeing these for a while now. Retail on them was 80 bucks, but I didn't want to pay that. Um, they were marked down to, I think, at the time, about $50. Um, but this time, they were $63.99, but you get half off. And I had a $5 reward. These are fire. It's like a peanut butter color, a relaxed fit cargo pants. So, you know, they're relaxed to the thigh, but they have um, a very wide leg, all right? so. If you're not into wide leg pants or, you know, a baggier look, these aren't going to be for you, all right? They have drawstrings at the end, but the quality on them is really good. Like, these are excellent pants. Um, and again, they retail for $80, so very nice. I love this color. They had navy blue and they had an olive green. I have a ton of olive green pants, so I figured I'd switch it up and get a pair of these. And these are going to look fire um with like some chunky sneakers or maybe some joy one low i paid 25 dollars or like 23 dollars or something like that for these these pants 
when they retail for 80 so all right so these next two pickups so this is part of the pack sun deal basically i bought this carrots t-shirt and then i got this shirt and the shorts for free this is a 30 dollars t-shirt but the retail on it is $40. And I will admit, I do like the shirt and the brand is dope. Uh, it's like a, it's a black owned brand, streetwear brand. Been checking them out for a while. But for what you get, it is expensive. So I wouldn't pay more than $30 for this t-shirt. Not at all. Carrots on the front. It's an off-white color. Very nice shirt though. Like the shirt itself is clean. You know, I pay 30, but I wouldn't pay 45. The shirt itself is dope. It's green, white, and orange with a cream tee. But I like how it contrasts with the white. So these are going to look dope with like an orange sneaker or something like that. I got something that I know for a fact I already want to pair with this. But, you know, for a a brand, a streetwear brand t-shirt, 30 bucks, and you get two for free, it's just a given in my opinion. This is just a yellow Sun basic t-shirt. Actually, this is more of a gold. This is like that Union gold, darker than Lightning Force and all that. So I like this, man. Um, I've been in the yellow lately, actually. Like, I feel like I bought, like, a good amount of yellow shirts and stuff recently. If you want to throw this under, like, a flannel or a denim jacket or something like that, or you can wear it but on its own, like I'm doing now, something pretty chill. And I always like to have basic t-shirts in my collection, whether they're a little bit on the more expensive side, like your Carhartt works in progress, or if you want to go cheap, like a Paxson t-shirt. All right, last pickup on the budget shopping list man this one surprised the hell out of me um i actually just figured out that we had this store nearby and i figured i'm gonna just go and give it a shot because i went in once and they weren't the price that they were today and i didn't think i was getting sneakers on this list for under 100 bucks but you guys see that a puma box puma box this is my very first style like this i've had i got pumas but I never had this. Damn, I almost broke the box. I never had this kind, but you gotta check this out. Classics, man. These are definitely a classic shoe. The Puma Suede. Man, these are very nice. I never owned these before. It does have like an off-white or a cream-colored Puma logo right there. These are like cool gray Pumas, man. You can't go wrong. And they actually have every single color in the outlet. They have blue, red, black uh certain ones were marked down certain ones weren't the only thing i will say um i think there are i think these might be considered like a b grade due to the fact that they were um in the outlets and i noticed that online on puma's website they actually come with extra laces they come with a white set of laces mine didn't that's not really a big deal to me considering the fact that i paid 24 dollars for these puma suede puma suede retail for i think 80 dollars um but they were marked down $25, man. I, I mean, how could you not? You know, maybe not, you don't get the extra laces, but it's literally the same shoe that's on Puma's website. This is one of those shoes you can dress up, dress down. You wanna go on a date. Uh, if you wanna, you know, rock it with some streetwear, I really believe that you can do that. But this is the best item on this list for 25 bucks. Let's see how much I spent. I totaled everything. I spent $106.98 about six to seven items. I think I did very well for this budget clothing shopping. So if you guys like videos like this, you guys want to see more content like this, uh, maybe we'll do a high end one one day, you know, got to save some money for that one though, all right? So I appreciate you guys coming through, showing love to the channel. If you like what you see here, go ahead and smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and your boy DB Kicks is out.